Hello everybody, Slim Kirby here. Welcome to more of the Super Mario Kart playthrough. It looks like it's finally time to use Peach. But, but, but Bowser. Yeah, let's use Bowser. Let's use Bowser. So yes, we are starting 100cc in this video today. And uh, as you can see, in 100cc, we actually have another cup down there that's not being shown to us yet. Guess we'll have to take gold and all these others before that one unlocks. So let's start with Mushroom Cup again. Okay, so I actually kind of talked about this a little bit earlier, but Bowser is actually really hard to use. Bowser and Donkey Kong Jr. are not going to be a lot of fun because he takes forever to freaking accelerate. This is not going to be an easy set of races, I'll say that right now, especially now that we're... Uh, Turning the difficulty up to Star Cup. Or not Star Cup, 100cc. In fact, I think I'm probably going to use uh, Donkey Kong Jr. very soon too, just so I don't have to use him in 150cc. Or even Special Cup for that matter, that's going to be hard. But yeah, the good thing about Bowser is once you do get him going, he actually is really fast. But because he is also hard to turn, uh, you're not going to be staying inside the track very much, so you just have to be very careful. You can't really afford to hit any items, or any blockades, or obstacles, or anything, though, know, so keep that in mind. So yeah, I'm going to have to be very careful right here, because I do not want to lose this race, especially the first one. Okay, get out of my way, Donkey Kong Jr. Alright, there we go. Wait, Bowser, why are you just sitting there? I guess I guess I glissed out Bowser because I hit a banana right before the finish line. That's kind of funny. Oh well, Mario is literally right behind me. He was not too far. Oh well, thank god, I won. So yes, now we're going to move on to the second race, Donut Plains. I think this one should be a little easier because I don't think Bowser controls extremely well on the Mario Circuit track, so this shouldn't be as bad as that one was. Oh yeah, I can already feel a difference. I can't do stuff like that though, that's just stupid. Yeah, I feel like for this game you do have to take a lot of turns wide. Because I think you honestly don't lose as much ground if you overdo a turn as opposed to uh, doing a turn too early so you hit the wall. Because then you can easily get stuck and that just doesn't really help anybody. I feel you can at least have some kind of control over the uh, spinning out from turning too wide. So yeah, as you can see, like, I have a lot of ground with Bowser right now, so he does have some really great top speed, and when you get a lot of coins, it's really going to show. It's just you have to kind of get those coins and get in first place first, because it'll take a while to get started with him. Plus, it's also really annoying because his top two rivals are Mario and Luigi who both have the Starman ability, and Starman is one of the most annoying abilities in the game. That's another thing that makes uh, racing against them extremely hard. But yes, let's go ahead and move on to Ghost Valley 1.
But as you can see, it is really annoying to kind of start the race in sixth place just because of his low acceleration. That's just the way it is, though. Also, take that. Luigi, why are you freaking so upset about that? He's your brother. He's stealing your spotlight. I figured you'd be happy that I'd take him out of the race. Yeah, when I was practicing this game for the playthrough, my god, Bowser just did not want to work with me at all. I'm surprised I'm actually doing this good with Bowser. I think it's, I think it's because I know his disadvantages now and everything. But as you can see, even with uh, being in first place with 20 coins, like, they're still catching up to me, so... There is definitely a uh, higher difficulty curve in uh, 100cc. But it is something we can work with, though, so I'm not too bummed about it. So let's move on to the next track, which I believe is Bowser's Home Course. Which means we can actually uh, maybe go really fast on this one, because I think that the Bowser's Castle tracks are equal to uh, Bowser's needs. That almost makes it sound like he's handicapped or something. He really feels like he is, though, with... Frickin' uh, acceleration. I mean, no frickin' offense by that, but it's just really hard. It's really hard and annoying to hit a wall and then just stop for like five seconds. If you like hit a wall or something and you hit the jump button just as you make contact, I feel like you can get kind of a boost jump off the wall. Which, if that's the case, that is actually kind of helpful. But again, I don't know for sure. And yeah, there's the uh, feather ability. As you can see, that can actually help too quite a bit. You can cut some really tight corners with it. good. I tried to hit Donkey Kong Jr., but I threw the shell in such a weird angle where it went right back at me. Oh, no, you're not going to win this, Mario. I'm not going to let you. So, like, as you see right there, I kind of hit the wall, but because I bounced out, I, I didn't really lose any momentum, so that really can help out in a pinch. Okay, well, we only have one more track to go, and it's uh, my favorite one, and uh, it doesn't matter what happens here, so we can just have some fun here and uh, maybe try to make Mario look like a fool. Yeah, I'd be game for that. not a good place for my banana to work. <laughs> I was kind of expecting it to go like near the jump, but no, it kind of backfired and a little bit. Oh goody, I, I have a mushroom. I want to see how this will work. 
because there's like a really huge, uh, not really a shortcut, but you can like get some huge air if you do this. Yeah. I freaking love doing that. Banana. Yes! I think I actually screwed up Mario. Yep! <laughs> he got stuck. I like. I like when Mario gets stuck like that. And see, he has a lot of ground to cover, too, because Luigi is, like, right next to me, and he still has, like, to go through the track another time. Oh, God. Luigi, don't do that. Well, I might actually get stuck in here. But no, I want to get first! Out of my way, Luigi! Out of my way! No. Nope. Yeah, you really need that mushroom when you get to that jump if you want to pass somebody in the last lap because there's not really a lot you can do at that point. It's okay, though. It's okay. I'm definitely going to win no matter what. Okay, cool. I like this. So yeah, let's uh, go ahead and see Bowser's victory pose. Congratulations! 100cc Mushroom Cup race. Bowser wins the gold. Great race. Uh, that's going to do it for another weekend of Mario Kart. Hope you guys enjoyed. I will see you guys next weekend for more. And, uh, yeah, hope you enjoyed. Later, folks.